Birkin. Where are we? In an igloo. Having lunch in an Where igloo. On the River Thames. Yeah, the Tower of London. It is spectacular. This is it. Oh, sorry, Pete. Take me on a tour. Here we go. <coughs> That's our igloo. It's a uh, 2468 birth igloo. Mm. There's a shard. So we glue. Look at Lisa. Look at her sexy. Oh, I'm not too that place. This is me in an igloo. Oh, that's my finger. Looking good. Michael. Is that a trick question? Where are we? Uh, the the North West End. We're at the West yes. End. Thank you. Been in this building okay. over here. Come out, come out, and I can walk. Uh -huh. What? <laughs> Can't see any dementors, Michael. Dementors? No dementors along this bridge today. What's a dementor? Huh? What's a dementor? What's a dementor? Harry Potter. Oh, okay. I can see St Paul's though. Not St Peter's. Sure, it's not St Peter's. No. Here it is. It's the Harry Potter Bridge. Now named as the Harry Potter Bridge. Shakespeare's Theatre, Dutch roof and all. There's Michael. It's about to go down. Go down. Go down. It's going down into the Thames. Don't do it, Michael. Don't do it. Life's not that bad. Oh no. That is dire. You'll last 120 seconds in there. 120 seconds, I'm in the French Channel. Yeah. So I hope you can say help in French. Yeah. Pas vu français. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yes, please. That'd be good. It's a big tunnel. Mark is going to demonstrate walking through the tunnel. 
There he goes. Let's pick him up. Magnificent. Oh, tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. That was great, Michael. <laughs> I might use you again. Okay. Just heading into Borough Market. You can see the shard up ahead. And oh my god, look at this. He's, I tell you what, he just straight to a pub. <laughs> straight there. Anyway, let's go and have a look. <laughs> How many men's toilets were there? Enough. How many? Enough. Two in the ladies. In the queue about 22. Did you have automatic hand washers though, Mason? No. Water, soap, no. so dry, all nope. in one line. You nope. need to come in the men's and have a look. Nope. Let's go. No, well, I've had them other places. Uh, not just not here. Where are we, Lisa? Borough Market. London. Borough Market and there is no shortage of gourmet delights here. Michael's just having a cheese and olive breadstick. Can you just pull a bit out of the bag Michael so we can have a look at it? It's delish and it's still warm still so warm. it's the best kind. Where's your beer? Just so that just a tasty little beer walking around the market as you do. So yeah life's good today. From York here somewhere and it's gorgeous. We didn't really care about the beer, but that's beer. okay. Thanks beer for sharing. Fantastic. Thanks for sharing. Have you ever run across one of them? Do yourself a favour. Okay, Lisa, where are you? I'd like to eat it because it's getting right. cold. Borough Market. What have you got down there? It's got Jag. Sweet oh, potato fries. Log <laughs> into it. I'm going to video. Can we not stand in the bin? What? can't say I'm a fan. Oh, we can't say that on video. We're going to delete that video. Yeah. Next minute at the market, found a cheeky little Prosecco. So we're just enjoying a little Prosecco as we continue to wander around the market. Hey, where are we, Lisa? London. Borough Markets. London. And, being a fruit and veg market, we've found ourselves some fresh grape juice. Nice. Nice. With bubbles. What's that for? So I'm currently walking across London Bridge, not to be confused with Tower Bridge. It's over there. Um, <laughs> over there. Next to the Tower of London, which is over there. Back to you. Thank you. So, there's a hijacker there. So just walking over London Bridge now. Not the prettiest of bridges, but, and I hope it doesn't fall down today. It's Pretty ugly, actually. This is the monument to the Tower of London fires. And apparently, there's like 400 or 600 steps or something up to the top, and if you climb up there, you get a certificate when you come all the way back down, which is yours to keep. Very impressive monument. So this is the garden where we're staying at the K and K George in Ells Court, London. I think it's very, pretty nice in the summer. You can just imagine sitting out here with a nice cocktail or a gin and tonic um, in the afternoon would be delightful. So where we have breakfast, we kind of look out these beautiful windows every morning. 
There's a light tree in there, more chairs. But it's just like a little oasis in the middle of the city. It's quite quite lovely actually. There's Michael. There's currently a heap of people inside having afternoon tea, which is very traditional in England. Have a bit of afternoon tea, scone with clotted cream. What's that thing, do you think? It's a uh, sculpture. So there we have it. Here's our little garden at Earl's Court. Hello, hello. We are coming from you live on the Eurostar. Been on here for about an hour and a half, and we've just crossed the border to France. And it is my birthday. Fifty years. Don't tell anyone. Don't look that old, do I? Well, we've probably been fifty for about twenty years, but anyway, Mark was here. Say hello, Mark. What? Where are you, Michael? Um, Calais somewhere. Somewhere in France, hey. Very excited. France. Yeah, France. So, I'll let you have a little look around. It's been it's very quiet in here, no one much is talking. Everyone's been on the piss all weekend and they're all sleeping. It's Sunday here, by the way. It's about half past two in the afternoon, but it's uh, just after midnight at home. So, I'm still selling one. Ready? Celebrating my birthday. We're not sleeping. We're not sleeping. Sleep when you're dead. Sleep when you're dead. You should make it into a song, Mark. <laughs> so here we go. I'll just show you a little brief look around. Not much to look at, really. We just uh, lean back out the window. Not much to look at. Unfortunately, we didn't plan this very well, but we don't actually have a window seat. We just have a wall. <laughs> That's okay. De croissant. 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 Hmm. De. It's pretty much all we're going to be eating, I think, for the next <laughs> the next four days. But you know, stay tuned. We do know how to order some.
is our Eurostar train. We're in carriage number four and had to make our way inside the train to carriage number eight for our drinks while it was going at like 300 kilometers an hour. It was a challenge, but one we're up for and succeeded. So there we go. That is the Eurostar, ladies and gentlemen. Done right. One press the go button here. It's cold. Now we're recording. We're recording now, Lisa. <laughs> you fucking idiot.